Hi there, it's Roy Breton from GardenEquipmentReview.com. Today we're looking at the Billy Goat QV900 HSP wheeled vacuum. This is a Billy Goat's top of the range model and it's currently selling for £4,009.98, pence, including VAT. Um, that is the most expensive model, it is the top of the range model, so it may not be everyone's uh, choice i appreciate everyone's got a budget um like a few days ago we looked at the the cheaper model so if you're looking for something cheaper um th there's a there's a wheeled vacuum here a self-propelled one which is uh 1419 pounds 99 and we do do have um cheap models as well you can you can see here um a range of different models you can change the change the sorting um, to, to how if you want it, price low to high, high to low, etc. Um, we also looked at um, if you're looking for something very small, petrol hand, uh, um, hand held petrol blowers just for blowing. There are a few with bags on, but I don't particularly recommend the ba bagging ones. And then we looked at um, backpack. Uh, petrol blowers which again have got more power than the handheld ones in general but anyway back to the billy goat um let's look at some of the features um it's powered by a 900 uh, sorry it's powered by a nine horsepower honda four stroke 270 cc engine um i've used honda engines quite a bit uh, over the years i've literally never had a problem with a honda engine i've never had anything um go wrong uh with one of their engines i've had i don't know how many engines i've owned or how many machines that have had a honda engine on but quite a few so that's definitely a good advert um i've also had them where I've, where they've been left a couple of years and haven't been started and uh, they literally start full first pull which is um quite something so uh, another good plus point um the vacuum's a quiet vacuum billy goat have gone um gone a long way to try and keep it quiet for sort of built up areas and to, to keep the noise down which is good um hydrostatic transmission uh down here um here we've got the, the hydrostatic transmission basically what hydrostatic transmission is it's um there's an oil pump and then you've got this hydraulic motor and that powers the wheels and it actually gives you instant forward and instant reverse at variable speed so there's no need for a clutch or a traditional gearbox you just got variable speed and it's definitely my preferred way of driving a, a lawnmower or sort of a, a small machine because it's so it's so so maneuverable and it's nice not having to change gear or you use a clutch almost like driving an automatic car but very practical in garden machinery um so that's a um a good plus point obviously a hydrostatic just cost a little bit more than a gearbox but uh, in my mind it's definitely worth having there's also steering clutches that help you aid um aid the machine i wouldn't have thought you particularly need uh, steering clutches but um that they do fit them um as i've said variable speed of forward and reverse that's six bladed impeller here there's an impeller that um, makes a vacuum it also chops the leaves the debris that you're collecting therefore making more space in the i think it's 131 131 liters i think the bag uh 136 liters um so i've got, got quite quite a size uh we yeah i've got it done here actually um and it's also got a the filtration system um on it that helps to keep the dust down so in dusty conditions um billy goat have tried to minimize it uh one more thing there's there's an optional hose attachment that i would recommend in my mind it should really be supplied with the optional hose um but uh, but being a vacuum because it just makes it much more versatile and enables you to get in places where the the stack the um, actual billy goat can't get so like behind sheds and uh, between flower pots and and so forth any anywhere you can't get at which is a good plus point um so to conclude um d d definitely uh, um a, a good powerful machine um billy goat are famous for making their uh, making their vacuums i've made them for uh, over 50 years now they're american built um like i say it may not be suitable for everyone's budget but i always say buy the best machine you can afford um because in the long run it will it works out cheaper i've had 
first-hand experience of that and I've seen that many times. Now if you've got any questions I'm here to help. I'm going to upload this video to YouTube. Um, please feel free to comment in the comment box. Thanks very much for watching.